Well, we have the most perfect day for you. A warm hello in every sense of the word. The sun is out and football has a special place on this most idyllic of days. A fixture ahead of us to which we've all been looking forward for so very, very long. And it means so very, very much. The scene could not be more beautiful. The pitch looks terrific. The players are ready to get started. And we cannot wait for the contest that lies ahead. Well, it is a great view inside Wembley. It gives it that special feeling no matter which match it is hosting. And so we stand for the anthems. Got the juices flowing, and now this. watering game this between two very high quality sides a treat for everybody here yes peter it's a shame it's only a, a friendly but then again that may help us see a more expressive attacking contest and i'd be prepared to settle for a, a clash of of lesser intensity in favor of, of lots of flair skill and plenty of tricks and a few goals i suspect i've probably overstretched my my level of greed here It's the whistle. Jim, which player is best equipped for this game? I would say Jan Vertonghen. Uh, whether it be at centre-back, full-back or wing-back, he's comfortable on the ball and, and likes to step up the pitch and, and take the odd risk. Um, he needed to add aggression to his game, and he has. Well, quite no argument from me on that one. Insigne. Now it's Perard. Perard! Italy! And Italy score first! Oh, beautifully dispatched. There was no reaching that. Well, you know, sometimes it pays off not to think too much about things, just put your foot through it, and that was a good example. Great contact, and the keeper had very little chance. Belgium didn't expect this, that's for sure. What can they do now? Torgan Azar goes on a charge down the left. Cristante gets it back. Lorenzo Insigne. Spinazzola. Cristante. Forward it goes. What an adventurous run from a defender. Courtois catches it safely. For Tongan. More than happy to take the muscular approach.
Denier. Talking as are. The Tongan. That a foul? Yes, the uh, referee's given it. Oh, that is asking for trouble. Cristante. Bonucci. Italy scored early, of course, and it's 1 0. Tries to get it forward quickly. Ocatelli. Cristante. And here's Berardi. Cut out in the nick of time. And it's Carrasco. Bonucci. All the way back and they start again. Spinazzola. Insigne done very well to intervene. Torreira Carrasco. And it's Mertens. And here's Lukaku. Good ball, it's found its target. Berardi, a scorer already in the game. Well, that's where he wants it. Tongan Torkan Azar finds him. Oh, he's going to be pulled back for that one. Alderweireld. Alderweireld drives it forward. Mertens. There's the ball. Massive leap! It's a promising run he's making on the right. Questions were asked, but he's given the answers. Tielemans. Half time getting close now. Immobile. Berardi. Chance! Oh, and they really should have been made to pay. Could move up a gear here. And he's on his way. And the shot! Mistake! A two-goal cushion, and it's looking safe. Swift, incisive, deadly, all done in a matter of seconds. Quick, decisive, and unerring. A textbook example of, of how to turn defence into counter-attack. That'll do for me every time. Italy have a couple of goals without reply, it's 2-0. Well, with this kind of authority, Peter, why not push on and, and totally kill this off? Out to the right. And the 
goalkeeper's in command. And the half-time whistle goes. It's the first half compared with your expectation. Well, it's looking pretty straightforward, Peter. They've got themselves into a, a very good position, so why dither from here when they can repeat their first-half success with a, another show of strength? Italy go in at half-time on a comfortable two-goal cushion. And the action is back on the way. Bonucci. Chiellini. Locatelli. Spinazzola. Chiellini. Bonucci. And it's Berardi. Look at the defender bombing forward. Gets away from his opponents. Meunier, De Bruyne, Tielemans, and here's Lukaku, can't get the better of his opposite number. Immobile, Berardi, Pereira Carrasco. Carrasco has got himself a free kick. It's come loose. Now it's Immobile. Brings it forward, now it's Immobile. He's one-on-one! -on -one. A chance! Hits one! Torgan Azar. Loses his balance and loses the ball. Berardi. It's a fine run and he's happy to keep going. Heads it! Oh, just needed a better contact. Belgium can defend those situations better by stopping the cross at source. So now we're going to get those changes we have been expecting. For Tongan. De Bruyne. Spinazzola positions himself well and cuts it out. Insigne, who does have an assist to his name. Now a chance to break. Lukaku, that's a promising ball, and the finish! Oh, surely that deserved better. It didn't quite come off on this occasion, but it only needs a gentle tweak. Italy can make their change now with the uh, breakaway. Play. Uh, 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 he's been drawn here, and he's certainly made his mark. mark. Yeah, yeah, he'll get a good ovation for his contribution. I'm, I'm not so, so sure why he's leaving us, though. There's no obvious sign, sign of an injury to the team. Lorenzo Insignia. They've been given a corner. Belgium making another change here. Tries 
Simply did enough. If you thought today's game, 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 game